guys, welcome back to Bully. Today we continue our adventure as Jimmy in Bullworth Academy. Uh, we actually have to head to class right now. We are still in chapter three and we are about to miss class. Here we go. As long as we don't have to go to English, Hello, I'm totally okay. Welcome to the world of biology. English I absolutely sucks. Strong stomachs. And what is biology about? This should be fun. Okay, so complete the dissection um, as accurately as possible before class ends. Right stick and left stick, aim pointer, A or R trigger, identify, hold A or trigger to use. RB slows the pointer. What? Use pins to secure the frog. Okay. Oh, this is disgusting. Did you guys ever do this in high school? I did this shit in high school. It was nasty. All right. Use a scalpel to make an incision. Disgusting. Take your time, boy. Dissection is an art. Use a scalpel to make an incision. Oh, God. Wait, does that mean we failed the first one? Maybe not. Ooh, we're probably gonna open this shit up. Use the forceps to peel. Ah, shit. Ah, disgusting. Holy shit. <laughs> this is actually kind of how it is. Holy hell. Use magnifying glass to identify the hearts. Well, that's easy. This is the heart. Use the scalpel to cut around the heart. All right, this is awesome. Yes, biology. Yes. Okay, now use the forceps to remove the heart and hold A to drag it. Okay. And put wow, it here. that's disgusting. Use the magnifying glass to identify the stomach. The stomach should be this. Let's see how fast we can cut around this. Patience, Hopkins. You can't rush science. Man, we've got literally less than a minute left to leave. He says you cannot rush science yet. You're rushing me. Okay, use the forceps. Remove the stomach. Okay, use the magnifying glass to identify the intestines. Fuck, I got 30 seconds to do this. Use the forceps. All right, we passed. <laughs> Let's see if you can keep it up, shall we? Well, that was quite disgusting. That was an interesting start to the episode. <gasps> Ladies Straight and gentlemen, welcome awesome. I'm done. to Bully. The game that doesn't stop quitting. I don't even know if that made any sense, but yeah. Here we go. We are at the auditorium, the Nutcracker mission. Okay. Oh, Jimmy, there you are. I've been looking all over for you. Why, Miss Peters, what's the matter? Well, you know how tonight is our Christmas pageant, right? It's kind of a pagan, spiritual, age-appropriate, loving thing we've got going on here. It's all about letting go and being really unselfconscious. Sounds like heaven, miss. Mmm, great. Well, we are about to go on stage in a couple of minutes, but our lead percussionist has appendicitis. Oh, that sucks. Guess it's gonna be a rhythm-free pageant this year. No, I've been planning this pageant for months. I have hand-sewn the costumes. I stayed up for days painting the backdrop for the stage. I've called on the good spirits to watch over us and all the parents are now waiting in the auditorium. Uh, so what do you want me to do about it? You have to get up on that stage and play. You have to save the Christmas pageant. Are you serious? 
Group participation in a public performance? No way! I'm a teenage boy. <laughs> no? What do you mean, no? You have to help me. Unless you plan on failing my course. What? You gotta be joking, right? Oh, come on. The only boys my age who like that kind of stuff end up dancing in musicals or working for Hollywood. Please. Do I look like I'm joking? You want another F, boy? Oh, that's fucked up. That's blackmail right there. Okay, okay, I'll do your stupid pageant. You know, for a hippie, you're a real bully, ma'am. Mm, he's <laughs> in love, Jimmy. Oh, and there's one other thing. You'll have to wear this. Oh, now I know you're joking. Oh, come on, Miss Peters. This is the kind of thing I'll have to talk to my therapist about when I'm older. Have a heart. I'll look like a complete moron in front of the whole school. Well, in my opinion, you look like the hero who saved the Christmas pageant. Yeah? Well, it's not your opinion I'm worried about. You'll be fine. All right, I don't know what the hell this mission's all about, but here we go. <laughs> oh, yeah! Wasn't that lovely? <laughs> oh, yes! <laughs> a fake-ass bitch. Thank you. And now for a real holiday treat, I give you the holiday medley. <laughs> yes. Bro. <laughs> Please don't mess this up, Jimmy. Oh, yes. Christmas depends on you. Oh, yes. Thank you. It's all good. Yes. What the fuck? What is this, dude? Alright, get ready. Begin. Okay, so it's one of these. When you kind of understand it, it makes a little more sense. Just so you know, I think we got this under full control. Yes, we do. No. Maybe we don't. Well, at least I'm not like those dudes back there in flower costumes. <laughs> I can't believe this guy, brother. I almost missed that one. 25% done, dude. What is this? This is torturous. Thirty-two percent. Come on, Jimmy, stay focused. We got this. We can do this. Thirty-five percent. are so focused right now on these boxes that I, I feel like I'm going blind. Yo, that was clutch! That was freaking clutch. <laughs> My teacher gave me $20 for hooking her up with that performance. No nutcracker outfit unlocked. Oh, that's pretty cool. I don't know you're gonna lock that costume. All right, we'll we'll take care of that later. Let's head into the weed the weed killer. What is this? Hmm, interesting. Hello, the biology teacher. You boy, don't just stand there. Come and help. What do you want, sir? Why did you send for me? I sent for you. Oh yes, I did. Look at that plant, boy. Magnificent, isn't it? A crapula maxima fortissima. A rare and precious Venus flytrap. Unfortunately, there is a boy at this school, Darby Harrington, who was given such a plant from his father. His father is not a nice man. Darby is not a nice boy. They keep that plant to belittle my collection. 
There are two sides to biology, boy. Life and death. Do I make myself clear? Very clear, you sir. Are you want me to weird. kill Darby Harrington? Yeah, I'll get right on that. Not the boy, boy! The plant! <laughs> kill the plant! He's about to kill oh. us. Right. <laughs> Yo, these teachers are fucking wild. Last episode, we had a teacher uh, make us get some panties, remove uh, any hats before going to Harrington House. Is that your please beat me? Um, remove any hats. Freaking hell, we gotta go to our dorm now. Uh, anyways, as I was saying, in the last episode, we had this freaking this guy make us go to the girls' dorm room and get literally dirty laundry, dirty panties from the girls, like. Borderline, not border, yeah, fucking full-fledged pedo. And I literally said that would not fly nowadays. But the fact that uh, back then, just life really didn't just give a damn. So we got to obviously have, I like how the game makes you do that. You got to have a certain style. Kind of blend in with people. That's that's cool. All right. So we're going to head outside and we're, see if we can take a bike. Wait, where is this? Oh, this is actually school property. All right, I'll take my skateboard. Don't mind if I do. Excuse me, nerds. <laughs> Good day, my friend. Good day, mate. Just... Holy hell! Me. It's crazy how when you, when you snow through those, uh, you you skateboard through the snow and it like fucks up your control. Attention to detail within the bully video game. I like it a lot. All right. Well, Talk to Biff. Oh, hello, Biff. Aren't you the guy who beat his your ass? After I beat your ass I'm gonna have your dad fired. Oh, yeah? My dad? What are you talking about? What are you talking about, Biff? Beat your ass. Holy fuck. Mm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid Biff! Find the prize plan and destroy it. Dude, their dorms are like super cool. Look at this dorm. Holy hell. It's fucking sick. Alright, so it's gotta be somewhere in here. Look at these rich fucks. Unbelievable. Where's this stinking plant? I gotta go upstairs. Let's go to the top here. So gotta be here for sure. Mother, I mean, oh, look at the plant. So use the poison to destroy the plant. Take. Destroy the plant. Holy hell. What, these guys are not gonna come at me? That shit's alive, bro. What is that? Like a dog in there or something. <laughs> this guy, Jimmy, goes on the stupidest missions ever. Plan is dead. Now they're going to come after me. I guess we can keep this too. Well, I'm going to mess you boys up. I will throw poison at your face. Get away from me. You like that? Oh, shit. Scram, punk. Oh, I can't keep that. Actually, you know what? We can just get out of here. Holy shit! Okay, I didn't know that I could break that. I would have broken it earlier. Yo, let me get some beam soda. Oh my god. Holy hell. You are so gonna get killed. Hey, let's talk this out, man. Yes. You want to bury your cremate? Yes, give me some beam soda. I love this move from my dad. Fuck your dad. Moron. 
not so tough now, huh? Beam soda, please. Alright, let's see if we can we knock this down. Oh. Stupid. Card in the bags. Let's get out of here. Oh, I thought I was gonna fail that. Thought I was gonna get killed. What happened? Whatever happened to being friends with the preps, dude? I mean, I literally knocked them all out in the boxing ring. So, <sighs> go to the mission. Rudy Red No Santa. Okay. Whew. Hey Santa, what's up? Well, if it isn't my favorite little help. Look at his Christmas tree. <laughs> oh no, I forgot. Little goody two shoes does it smoke. So, what are you up to? This uh, doesn't look like much of a workshop. I know. We gotta fix this dump up. <clears throat> look through some trash cans for ornaments or any junk that sparkles. This is a classy operation. We gotta look the part. Oh, come on, man. With your whiskey breath and your weird manner? You just scream Christmas spirit to me. Of course, I do. But this dump needs to look nice. You leave it to me, Mr. Claus. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go. So, Santa needs decorations. Find any trash that sparkles. Santa, bro. He is not Santa. Do not confuse Santa with that freaking weirdo. Right, so, we got one of here. Should have probably taken the bike much quicker. Another one here. This is actually pretty easy. I'll take this bike. This is my favorite bike, this BMX. Oh, what the heck? What is this garbage? <laughs> I just ran over the dog and I got fucking dwarfs after me. Oh wait, sorry, elves. They are elves. Hold on. I, I can pick up things even on my bike, so that's fine. Got another package over here. Bro. Pick that up, Jimmy. Oh, what the hell? Bring the trash back to Santa. Alright, here we go. I would have okay, fought man. them, but we had a time. all the junk I could find. Nice going, kid. I think we're just about ready for business. Oh, by the way, you brought a camera, right? I'm afraid the elves let me down this year. Yeah, I kind of figured they would. Don't worry, I got it covered. Good. Now, go stand over there and make me, I, I mean us, rich. Ho, ho, ho! <clears throat> Make sure the children are smiling in their photos. Ow! I'm bunions! Are you insane? Over here! <laughs> <laughs> Good pictures, take four more. Yo, that's hilarious. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, he smiled for like a quick second. I smile. Why should I? You suck. Look at the camera. Turn around. There we go, got it. Alright, maggots, who's next? <laughs> Yo, these bitches are so stupid. Hi Santa, you're the <laughs> I want lots of presents this year, okay? Got another one more Santa, let's go. <laughs> Fucking bum. Is <laughs> you. Does your son have rocket boosters? Is it eco-friendly? What do you mean? She's smiling right there. Looking for a tutor or something? I got my what? PhD at the school of hard knocks. That's not. There we go. 
Sorry, kid. Places to be. Reindeer to feed. I think it was five pictures, not four. He's like horse poop. He's like horse poop and rubbing alcohol. If I had a nickel for every time I'd heard that. Sin is thirsty. Let's get this over with. Got it. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. I haven't seen this much dough since my days at the track. <laughs> the track? Um, yeah. You know, uh, the, the, the reindeer games and, um, uh, oh, hey, I might be able to catch the last race. Gotta go, kid. Uh, here's your cut. That was easy. Oh man, we just worked for Santa Claus. What the hell's going on here? For some reason. What even is this game? We just got played by Santa Claus, the hobo version of it. Not even the real Santa Claus. Unbelievable, Jimmy. You got played, son. All right, we got a new mission here. Jealous Johnny. All right. So you came. Yep. I bet you think I'm funny, don't you? A laughing stock? Not really. I mean, you dress a little weird, but. Yeah, and everyone is laughing at me. All of you, at me! What are you talking about? Don't play dumb with me. Have you had her? Who are you talking about? I bet you have. <laughs> have you had what her? What are you doing? Who? Lola! That slut! That slut... I love. <laughs> no, man! <laughs> She's cheating on me, man. I know she is. <laughs> the little slut. It's killing me. <clears throat> me, dying over abroad. Oh, man, I knew this was coming. What are you talking about? She's with that rich kid, Gord. I know she is. How do you know? <clears throat> Will you find out for me? I can't take the suspense. Look, meet me at the underpass near New Coventry tonight. We'll get evidence. Bring a camera, and then we'll settle this once and for all. Oh, my God. We're going to stalk this chick. Because our buddy, old pal here, Jealous Johnny. Okay, take photos of Lola kissing, holding hands, and getting gifts from Gord. Right, kissing, holding hands, and getting gifts. Right, let's, don't we have a bike here? Okay. Alright, let's just go. <clears throat> Where's my camera? Oh, thank you. <laughs> You're such a bad boy. <laughs> Where is she? Strangely attracted to you. Howdy. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, so I'm gonna have to take pictures of them over here. Holy hell. Yo, we're stalking these people for real, bro. For me? Oh, thank you. You're such a bad boy. <laughs> oh, they went to the alley. That new clothing store is just so trashy. Freaking hell! Boo. Settle down, child. They're kissing! Okay, good, got that. Now we need one more of them, uh, or her receiving a gift from him. I mean, all I need is a fucking kiss or holding hands, and it's 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 a wrap, bro. We don't need all three, all three freaking reasons why you should leave this quote unquote slut. Got it. Oh, thank Damn, return the photos to Johnny. <laughs> oh, he's gonna be heartbroken, dude. Poor Johnny. My boy's gonna have his heart broken. Here are the pictures, 
County. Lola's a bit of a slut, it seems. I knew it! I just knew it! Well, we got Grease to respect. This is like the new uh, tier of um of people that we're dealing with. Nice First it was work, nerds, Jimmy. then it was preps, now it's greasers, then it's probably gonna be jocks. Ooh, we got another mission here. What is it? I saw that Bates. Probably Johnny as well. What's this gourd kid got that I ain't got? Uh nothing. You think it's funny, don't you? You think I'm a joke? Well, my little friend, I'm the king around here. Me! I know. You're the king. But my queen is a slut, and now everybody's laughing at me. Well, not anymore. I'm not laughing. Good. Good, kid. You and me, we're gonna teach young Gord to keep his dirty paws off my woman. My queen. Get him to the abandoned building in New Coventry behind Union Hall. I'll be waiting there to school that little weasel. I'll be there. That little weasel. Who uses that word? What is wrong with you, Johnny? Find Gord in uh, Bullworth Town. All right, let's get out of here. Let's, actually, let's get our skateboard. Man, I should be using this freaking bicycle, dude. Oh, he's over there. So how do we make him go where we need him to go? Provoke Gord and get him to follow you. <laughs> Lead uh, to Johnny at the bike park. Holy hell. <laughs> oh, shit. Alright, they're right behind me. The bike park. I don't think we've ever been to the bike park. Oh, it's right here. There's our cop there. All right, drop the bike. I mean, skateboard. Right over here. Here we go. Oh, it's daytime now. Okay. Seems like you've been messing where you ought not. No, cousins are legal. Oh, you mean Lola? Yeah, my woman. <laughs> now you pay. Cousins are legal. <laughs> He's banging his cousin too. Help Johnny beat up the preps. Okay, um. Um. I'll just stand here. Relatively easy. There we go. That's all we gotta do. Give me my nice little slingshot. Here we go, we got this. Is it even hitting them? Yes. All right, good. I don't know why I would do this in a bike. Maybe it's better, easier. But this is working out. They're throwing rockets, dude. What the hell? We could have actually gotten those firecrackers and done it, but whatever. What's done is done. More respect from the there greasers. Done. Greasers. Greasers. Tomato, tomato. See? Firecrackers. I don't know if we can just pick them up. I was like, how are they just suddenly manufacturing firecrackers out of thin air? Pull back on um, Papa Wheelie. Oh, we know. We know. Let's see. What can we do here? Can we actually ride the bike? That's pretty cool. <laughs> oh, okay, so push forward on the stick while holding to perform an endo. Shift your way backwards to perform a backflip? Really? Okay, hold on. Just, like, <laughs> just get out of here, Jimmy. You're not meant for this life. <laughs> nice slam. I'm just gonna leave, okay? Stop. Get 
Get out of the bike, Jimmy. You're not you're not meant for that lifestyle. All right, so we've got two missions over there that we can head to. All right, so we can probably head that way straight. I wish that we could actually um, have a bike around here to catch. Would make my life a whole lot easier, honestly. Skateboarding is a, a, a nice method, but it's not the fastest way. So in order to get there quicker, we can make a left at the end and go down the hall. Maybe we should sleep, dude. It's nighttime, and I'm not really a big fan of nighttime. But I also feel like if we do it at nighttime, we don't miss classes. If you do things during the night, you don't miss your classes. You know what I mean? Not that I really care about my classes. I mean, who gives a shit about that, right? I mean, it's bully. Nobody cares. I'm sure you probably get something cool when you finish them. <clears throat> it seems like one of those things that would give you an incentive. All right, so this is actually in school. So we can actually sleep. Let's sleep just so we can have a little bit of a brighter atmosphere here. I feel like it's going to be just overall more appealing to the gameplay experience. Let's go. Nice, Jimmy. Just bust your ass all day long. You've just been busting your ass. Okay, we're going to sleep. I also like how <clears throat> everything in the story, he starts collecting inside his room. Like, he's got the boxing gloves. He's got the... Uh, the pictures of his girlfriends. That's freaking cool, dude. All right, we're gonna save the game just in case. All right, I'm gonna go here. Amigo, I need your help. Amigo, Johnny and his goons were hassling me about algae. That guy's gone even crazier. He thinks algae is trying to put the moves on his girl. Algae and Lola? I know. It's crazy! Everyone knows Algy likes blondes! Listen, find Algy and get him back here until Johnny comes to his senses! Where is he? I don't know. I know he was working on a math project for Hattrick with Cornelius. Maybe he knows where Algy is. Who? Cornelius. You know, the scrawny kid in the acting club. He did an amazing Juliet in the school play. <laughs> I think he has a 4.0 grade point average. All right. Let's go. All right, so look around for Cornelius. Where is Cornelius? Oh, he's right here. This is exactly where we came from. What the hell? Oh, he's getting... Oh! Walking beanpole. Oh! Mm. He's at the pizza parlor, okay? Please let me go now. The pizza oh, parlor. You we know you know where he is. is. Shut up, Gary. Fight, fight, you guys fight. get Algie and bring him to me at the clubhouse. You guys take care of this pathetic excuse for a human being. I was hoping you'd say that. Help me! Please, anybody! Oh my god. Guys. Guys, just stop. Stop, greasers. You got it, bro. Alright, let's go help him. So, travel to Algae in a new commentary. Alright, here we go. So, we're probably gonna have a con uh, conflict now with uh, this guy. Yo, give me that bike. We were just buddy old pals with Johnny, but now it looks like uh, all that's gonna go to shit. All right. It's all the way over here. And we've got a tank class. Holy hell. There's too much to handle, damn it. Too many responsibilities and to do's and this and that. I just wanna be a kid. I wanna live free. I wanna be a bully. I don't wanna have to go to school. Nobody does. Right through here. Oh, we've never been here. But it feels like every time we go deeper and deeper into the map. Algy, you're in so much trouble with Johnny Vincent and his boys. Why would he be? Oh my God. So, Chad, honey, listen. It's just a hundred bucks. 
That's nothing to a man of your means. Gold digger, oh, but bro. Lola, I'd have to steal it off of my father. But Lola, I thought Will that me and you... up, that's so... Oh. Big bones, not that. I thought you liked <laughs> me. You said you did. I do. Yo, I, I really do. Them. Some friend you turned out to be. You must think I'm really cheap. Just a cheap slut. Well, that's it. No, no, no. Oh, but oh, 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 wait. Wait. Ass. Ridiculous. Women. Oh. Look at you both. You're pathetic. But, but I, I thought, thought you liked, liked me. me. I don't believe this. You both better get over oh, it. No. Listen, we gotta get out of here before Johnny Vincent sees you hanging out with his girlfriend. Oh, Algie, you take the girl's bike. Chad, oh, you better pedal for both great. of us. I get a feeling I'm headed for a fight. Oh, we're gonna have to fight Johnny. Holy but, shit. Uh, but I was just helping Lola study, honestly. I'm so scared. What? Well, he's gotta be around here somewhere. Let's go find him. There they are, on those bikes. Is that Algy? On a girl's bike? Here they go. Hold off the greasers. That's a big greaser right there. Oh, we got this. <laughs> oh shit, they're, th they're throwing firecrackers at us. Hold it, it does more damage. Okay. Versus just pressing it. <laughs> Holy hell. Oh my god. <laughs> Some of these missions are pretty cool, dude. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, they really got creative with them. Knock them down. I think we're good to go. Probably gonna be more coming. Any minute here. Come on, you stinking greasers. I think we lost them. Good. I'm getting tired. Give me a minute to catch my breath. Ew. It's a trap! It's a trap! Chad, step on it! Oh, damn. Holy hell. Chad, you got this, bro. <laughs> you guys got no chance. I'm from a Call of Duty background. This is like a walk in the park for me. You not understand? Where the heck are we even supposed to go? All the way to the library? Why is it so freaking far away? It's like we're taking the longest route there. Slingshot shots are not half bad, though. I'm not here slaying these kids. All right, we're by the bridge now. This is good. We're nearly there, Jimmy. Just hold them off a little longer. Headed into the school on the right-hand side to our left now. It's gonna be coming. <clears throat> oh, um, take Algy to Ernest. Why would you be jealous of Algy, dude? I mean, just take a look at him. Come over to the observatory and play a game or two of Prados and Gremlins with us sometime. Um, no. <laughs> we just lost respect for the greasers. Or from the greasers. Jimmy comes through again. God damn it, Jimmy. Again, I feel like we're not necessarily the bully in this game. We're more like the hero, the savior of the nerds. Or of just people in general. We do bully things as well, but... Actually, wait. We're not supposed to go here. I gotta be honest. I... I, I don't really want to go to class again. 
I'm just gonna go to the mission for this one, guys. Hope you don't mind. Holy hell. How's cool. Alright, we're gonna go to the other side of class or school, better yet. So I think that's the library. you. Is that any way to greet your new boss, Harrington? Well, is it? Hmm, uh, no. No what? No, sir. That's better. At ease, girls. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> boss, those grease monkeys are making life very difficult for <clears throat> Gord. That's because Gord was showing one of their girlfriends a good time. Some leader you turned out to be. Father says leadership is about looking after those you lead. He taught me that right before he laid everyone off. So what do you want me to do? Send them a message all over their dirty little slum. Why should I? Because you're the boss. Exactly. I'm the boss, and I'll go send the message. All right, so travel to the new Coventry. Where the hell is that? Oh, God. Far as shit. Oh, can we hit that? Yeah. One out of 25 gnomes. Pretty cool. Yeah, what again, we've never been here. This is, this is cool shit. <clears throat> or at least probably we have, but we haven't been through here. We need a code for that? Wait, what? Oh, we don't have the key or the code. <clears throat> Pretty cool, though. I wonder what's back there. I can hurt someone. We've got a this. plank on us just in case any of these greasers think they can just come here and bully me like that. Well, guess what, punks? I don't think so. Not today. We're leaving school territory again. Probably gonna slap a kid around the face, steal his bike, and uh, get back to business. It would be really funny, although it wouldn't kind of make sense, but it'd be hilarious. If you could also drive the cars in this game, that'd be funny. Then again, we're, we're 15 years old. It's not like that would actually be probable, but I mean, then again, everything that's being done in this game is kind of outrageous. So I think that would be pretty, <clears throat> pretty funny. I think it, it would be fun. And it, maybe if they like gave you a really, really hard time while you're driving it, like a bunch of cops after you or something like that, that that'd be honest. Lay down your tag. Oh, that's cool. Jimmy was here. <laughs> Jimmy was here. That's funny, dude. Okay. Where is it? Where do we go? Is it on the other side or is it inside there? Is it in here? <clears throat> Great deals today. No, it's not in here. What the heck? What if it's up top? What if we gotta climb up there? Oh, it's in the back, maybe? Um. Um. All right, I'm a little confused. Look who's it's got to be in here. Yum Yum Market. Hey, dude. Totally a nice guy. Um. Spray paint. Always a good prize. Oh, I had to buy spray paint. Lay down five greaser insult tags. Oh, I see. That yeah, that's easy. one. We've got to be careful with the, uh... Hopefully they don't spot me. Hopefully they don't spot me. Hopefully they don't spot me. Now that looks good. All right, here we go. We've got one more back there. Actually, we got two over here. Or four. Holy hell. 
over here, back here. There's nobody watching. <clears throat> this is all Greece, your territory. This reminds me of Greece, the movie Greece. I don't know if you guys have seen it. Good work. I'm probably gonna watch it tonight. Such a great movie. If you guys have never seen Greece, man, you definitely gotta watch it. It's like a 70s or 80s movie. I forgot what year it was, but one of the best movies ever made. Okay, one more, guys. The other one's definitely at the roof, but we got an easier one <clears throat> all the way back here. There's probably nobody here to fuck with us anyways. Take a bath, greaser. <laughs> Greasy. <laughs> it's funny because... <clears throat> Somebody is gonna get their freaking lights knocked out. Who could ever call this art? So all the respect we gained from them is gone. We gained 10 respect from the two missions we did with Johnny, and now and all that gone. is gone. As long as you have a spray, you can lay a tag down at any tag targets. Okay, so the next mission is actually right around the corner. Let's see, we've got... Uh, we got a red star and a yellow star. Let's do the red one. I mean the yellow one. Here we go. Hey you! I got something for you to do. Lola's race. Of course I love you, Johnny. No, you don't. Love is complicated. That didn't seem complicated between you and that Gordo kid. I'm gonna kill him. Johnny, please. We've been over that. He's sweet, but it was so innocent. Get off. Oh, I love it when you get angry, Johnny. I really do. You're so bestial. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, what are you doing here? Looking for you, Johnny. At Lola's house? Yeah. Be nice to each other. You know what I like about you two? You're both so straightforward, so quick to judge, so fast. Ain't no one fast like me. <laughs> really? So you could beat Jimmy in a race? <clears throat> Definitely. I heard he was pretty fast. This little twerp? Give me a break. Oh, I think we've got a little challenge. I just what love slut, challenges. <laughs> they make me so excited. Oh, dude, we're gonna wipe her up too. <laughs> Let's go, collecting them numbers. Remember, a wheel ain't a wheel without no smokes. chance against Johnny and his boys. All right, here we go. Lola's race. Oh, so they can actually punch me? At least this bike doesn't like slip on the ice or on the snow. Really, really helpful. Now these guys are a little fucking fast here. Oh, you can throw this. Nice. I don't know you can throw that in the race. There's only one lap, right? Yes. Okay, good. My thumb is already killing me, bro. What if we throw this? Oh, we can't throw marbles. <laughs> that would have been awesome. Yo, he's right behind me, too. Holy hell. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Johnny guy ain't fucking around. He ain't fucking around. Holy crap, the camera. Holy shit. Oh no, I should have gone right. <gasps> no. Yes! No! I probably could have gone through there if I, if I would have broken that. Oh no, he's taking all these fucking shortcuts. <laughs> Did you see? <laughs> he's getting his goons. <laughs> to slow me down. 
pretty uh, tempting challenge where the opponent you are, Johnny. But trash indeed you remain. Holy hell, we went around the entire block. Okay, and I keep spamming X or A, I mean. I'm gonna hold it down, which honestly doesn't make a big difference if you don't. Kind of weird, like if you spam, if you spam A, it doesn't really make a difference, like in comparison to you holding it down. Oof, look at that. Woo! <laughs> that was a pretty challenging race. Not even gonna. I'm not even gonna lie. I thought I was gonna lose there towards the end. All right, Timmy, you won. Well, of course my bike wasn't tuned right. I'm gonna head to the shop and do some work on it. More bike talk? I'll meet you guys later. I've been waiting for this. I should teach lessons or something. Come here, girl. I wish something. Hey, you. You have nice lips. I got something lips. for you to do. Sorry, cop. Some kids like to write on walls that don't belong to them. You got Sorry, cop, can you get out of the scene here? Wow, Jimmy. You're so For the love of God, I'm I've got to tell you something. Nice lip gloss. Yeah, that's right. Wasn't that great? All right, you know what? I'm just gonna get out of here. I don't, I don't want, I don't want any trouble, dude. Okay, I don't want any trouble. Just want to do my missions and get out of here. That is all. All right, so we've got two more. We've got uh, one straight ahead of us. Let's do the one right in front of us, and then there's a couple more after. Uh, we got this one right here. Let's see. Let's go, Skitty. The tenements. Tenements? 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 Hey, good looking. What's up? Oh, oh, you're so angry. But I think you've got a softer side. Haven't you caused enough trouble? That's not fair. I'm a nice girl. I'm nice to everyone. Now, everyone hates me. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry. Well, okay. But now Johnny and his boys won't even speak to me. Boys can get really jealous when they find out you've been kissing another boy. It wasn't like that. I'm not like that. Okay. But I left all my things in the abandoned tenements where they hang out. My address book, my keys, my perfume, my lipstick, even my laundry. Everything. Now I've got nothing. I don't have much money. That's too bad. Maybe you could get them back for me? You want me to steal your stuff back from a bloodthirsty mob of angry greaseballs? I'd be very grateful, Jimmy. <laughs> very grateful. She's naughty, naughty. This is the naughtiest girlfriend we've had. <laughs> Alright, enter the tenements. Alright, let's do this. This is not gonna be good, dude. We're gonna get our asses killed here. There is no job too great for Jimmy. Here we go. Okay, is it through here? Have you ever okay, what? Alright, here we go. This is like the projects, the ghetto part of this game, if you will. Mine. Better collect this. Oh, radio transitor. Transitor. Nice. That's probably for the bum. So now when we got another task from, we've got that already handy. Alright, so collect all the items. Oh, hell no. Come here, stupid. Get a beam soda. Thank you. Okay. I wish stealing bikes was easy. We're gonna go here. What are we gonna do about it? 
Get Lola's. What is this? Lola's address book. Holy hell. Fuck! Here, have some eggs. Can we get a beam soda, please? No? Okay, he had nothing for me. My health is still relatively high, so we're good. I think we can probably break this. Okay, what if we... I could probably just... Oh, no. <laughs> Here, you want some eggs? <laughs> oh, fuck. I'll get my slingshot. Thank you for the beam soda. Slingshot is definitely the way to go. It just it just takes them down like really fast. I'm just gonna start using this. See this? You see that? One hit of quitters, bro. One hit of quitters. Okay, so now we just find a way to knock down the walls. Boys, it's Timmy. You want me to do? Okay, we gotta find a way to knock that down. can knock that down. How do we get... Okay, I'm gonna go through here. Can we go through here? Let's see what do we got here? Hold on. I'm gonna smoke your butt with my food. Yo, this slingshot is OP, dude. Holy hell. Oh my god. I should be using this more often, honestly. Shit, look at this. It's super powerful. Step back. Step back, punk. <laughs> That's what I thought. Okay, no need for the beam soda. If there's tracks nearby, you're on the wrong side of them. Link shots for the win. We go. Two shots of the slingshots and they're done. And yeah, there's one of her belongings here. I don't even know why she would live here. Like, this is disgusting. Like, not even furniture. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? Oh, that's the hammer that we need. Uh, taking out the trash. Looks like that's what I have to do. I just love wrecking things with my hammer. <laughs> Gets freaking huge. <laughs> this is too much power. Norton is the ultimate grease ball. Alright, can we throw. <laughs> oh, he doesn't slip on the marbles? Oh, this is a lot more damage to him. Nice. Perfect. I thought. I figured. Alright, so now we got this. And smash the walls. Uh, or not. Maybe that's not a smashable wall. We're gonna go downstairs. Like cobweb everywhere. This is disgusting, bro. What's going on? Damn greasers. You are disgusting. Can we open up this door? Um... Okay, but what the hell do we do here? Can we just break it? <laughs> no. There we go. I thought I was going to get stuck or glitched here for a second. I'm not even going to lie. All right, let's go downstairs. Gonna collect this. Lola's lipstick. Nice. Great. Lola's keys. <clears throat> and then we've got uh, the last thing here. Her perfume. What's this? Leave the tenements. 
<clears throat> Damn, dude. I wish we could keep that hammer. That's pretty badass. All right. Return items to Lola. All right. So we're probably going to have a bunch of greasers on our ass now. So we are in greaser territory. All right. You know what? Fuck this. <laughs> Yo, they're everywhere. All right, there she is. Hola, I want nothing else from you. God damn it. You're nothing but trouble. Thanks, honey. You and your Feel stupid great. belongings. Oh, let me get a kiss. Scrumptious. Delicious. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty great. Thanks, lols. My work here is done. All right, we've got, uh, dude, stop. I don't want to help anybody. The rumble. Bro, stop. No, stop. I want to start this mission. Huh. There he is, my hero. What's your problem now? If you really cared about me, you'd fight for me. First of all, I'm not sure I really care about you. Oh. And second, what do you think I've been doing? Tad fights for me, Gord fights for me, Johnny... Well, he certainly fights for me. In fact, they're all about to fight for me. Right now. Everyone apart from you. Who's fighting? Tad and all the rich kids are coming here to fight Johnny and his boys. All because of me. I'm like Helen of Troy. So there's going to be a big fight? A winner-take-all sort of thing? Yes. Everyone's involved apart from you. I'm Helen of Troy, and you're more interested in boys called Troy. Whatever. See you later. Of course. Gets jealous when... She realizes that people don't care about her. Typical woman. Not typical, but typical slut. All right. Some women don't, don't act like that. But these little game sluts, yes, they do. Yes, they do indeed. All right, so we're headed over to... I don't even know where. We're headed to Johnny? Where are we going right now? We're we going back to where we came from. Tenements. Oh shoot. Now tell me where Johnny is so I can finish him off. I know where he is, but I ain't telling you nothing. Um sure. Back to the alleyway. Who won? Me, <coughs> Jimmy Hopkins. That's who. Who won? You. Who? Jimmy Hopkins. Correct. That's right, ladies. Me. I'm the daddy now. <laughs> you treacherous little snake. You think you're tough, huh? You don't need any more of this, Johnny. You laugh at me. You turn on me, you get it on with that harlot who I, I love, uh, I'm gonna destroy you. All right, calm down, man. It's cool. You lost, no big deal. We can all be friends. You're done, kid. Finished. Aw, oh, shit. You'll learn to keep your hands off my girl. Oh, what the frickin' hell? Get out of here, the cops. You're lucky, Jimmy. I'll kick your ass later. Get back here. What the freaking hell? He literally kicked my ass. Is that part of the mission? I'll run the yeah, it is. I'll run the cops. Running from the cops. 
Dude, they're chasing me in a cop car. <laughs> this is not even fair. <laughs> the fight. Let's go. Ah, I don't have anything. I thought I had marbles. Although marbles probably wouldn't do anything to a car, but. See how long we gotta keep this up for. Get out of here! The cops! This has been a pretty long episode, dude. Holy hell. I've been recording for an hour and a half already. I'd be a little bit shorter than that, but damn. Oh! Holy hell! Alright, Johnny. Come here now, punk! My slingshot. There we go. We got this. Hit Johnny right here. Come here, Johnny. Get out that bike. Stupid. Get out of the bike, stupid. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's gonna come for me. Come here, Johnny. Come here, Johnny. Kick your ass. Huh? You have no idea what this bump taught me. There's a bump behind our school that taught me how to kick your ass. Here. <laughs> Get up, Johnny. Come on. Get up, Johnny. Mm. Holy hell. Oh. oh, no. I'm just toying with you, kid. Nice. Can we just beat his ass? That's fucking awesome. I told you. I was the daddy. Got it? I'm in charge. You do what I say. All right. I give up. You can have her. Who? What are you talking about, Johnny? Lola, you win. She's yours. This has nothing to do with her, man. I don't care. You can keep that slut for yourself. <laughs> what? <laughs> you don't want her? Then why did you do this? Why'd you fight? Just to prove you're tougher than me? That's right. And don't you or your boys forget it. I'm tougher than you. So maybe now you'll stop bullying everyone. You work for me now. Oh, man. Yo, this game is fucking something else, dude. I'm starting to feel pretty good about myself. I've just taken control of two of the school's worst cliques, but I know there are bigger problems just around the corner. Problems with overdeveloped pituitary glands and brains the size of peas. The thing is, Pete, now that I'm cool, I'm not sure we can be <laughs> friends anymore. What? I'm messing with you. Oh, I was Real about funny, to say, dude. dude. Well, when you're done with this place, a career on the stage awaits. Maybe, maybe like a male stripper or something, huh? What? Uh, <clears throat> so, um, what about Gary? I haven't seen him. <laughs> but whenever I hear somebody say I used to be a girl and had a sex change, or that my mother slept with Crabble Snitch to get me in here, I think to myself, Gary, Gary, what a jerk. You don't even call me a dork. Well, I guess he's not always wrong. Is that what you really think? <sighs> Whatever, Jimmy. You know, I stand up for you, and you still think I'm a dork. You're a jerk, and you're a dork, so we're equal. Whatever. I'm leaving. Ow! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> now maybe next time you'll watch where you're going. What'd you do that for? Oh, I'm sorry, Psycho. Did oh. I hit your boyfriend? Yes, yeah, Psycho. You gonna try to kick our asses now? No, I think I'll do that more publicly. Ooh, I'm really scared right now. Really Ooh. scared. I take down oh. linebackers every day, oh. pal. Whatever, pretty boy. You'll get yours. <laughs> yeah, we'll see about that. Go have some fun in the communal showers. Ooh, I just dropped my soap. Please pick it up for me. Losers. Petey, get up. I, mean, Jimmy, I think we found some new people to have some fun with. So yeah, this is going to be the chapter of Jimmy, the jocks. Go. As you can see, Christmas is over. Now we've got ourselves uh, regular January, possibly. February. I don't know what month it is. 
but I'm, I'm i'm really looking forward to this chapter the chapter of the jocks it's gonna be fun we're gonna go ahead here and save the game and uh just make sure we don't lose anything this was a pretty long chapter and i didn't know that if you got to the last mission you didn't have to do the other ones if not i would have done the other ones but anyways i think we're gonna end this episode here i've got three posters of three different girlfriends now so uh <laughs> jimmy's out here pimping it thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed it as always if you did drop it a like rating <laughs> i'll catch you later